Hi and happy Sunday, beautiful collective. Thanks for coming by the channel today. If you hear some funny noise, that's my coffee maker percolating. I'm making fresh ground coffee. It's it's my jam. That's me. Collectives, I want to thank you so very much for all your likes, your comments, and your subscriptions. So just know that. I'm going to do something different today and I'm going to pull on the tea leaves and see what's going on with these soulmates and separation. What information can the universe give me about these uh, soulmates that are in separation, these kindred relationships? Take it at. Ooh. What's going on? Strong emotions. Passionate love or hate. Trying to overcome obstacles or challenges. Key to success here. Transformation. A change for the better. Hmm. Well, obviously for the collective, it's a change for the better. What's going on? Ooh. Well, it's not so troublesome over there. They're trying to triumph over troubles and obstacles, but there's trouble and accusations, strong emotions, passion and hate. You mix those two together, boy, it's war. You're getting success here. An increase in material wealth and spiritual growth. You are triumphing. Oh, the lion here. It's time to act. Mm, telling this person it's time to act. Mm. An exciting event. Mm. Yeah, getting together with friends. Had a secret admirer. Thought they were going to have strong passion. Ooh, period of frustrations, lessons to be learned, they're being taught a lesson. Beware of greed. They got a reason to worry. The whale card came in reverse. Great worry over nothing. They have a reason to worry, Spirit is saying. <laughs> Pay attention to your purse strings. It's in reverse. They've lost a lot of money. Something to do with October, a wedge, somebody deliberately trying to cause a wedge in between you and someone you cared about. December is here. Something could have been over because people were working behind your back. That simple. What's currently going on for this energy? short journey oh muddled unclear thinking they weren't thinking it set off a chain of events in their life that's going yeah started this romance <laughs> and get together with friends now they're going to court <laughs> There's a fine line between love and hate, they say, or passion. It's not even love. It was passion and hatred. Well, I think it's turned into hatred. Let's see. The gavel. Woo. Hang on, guys. They're dealing with a shark. <laughs> yeah, take care. You're going to have a loss of material wealth. The good luck is in reverse. They were too stubborn. Ooh, what's this? Wants to show. Maybe this karma got pregnant or they started a business. It's not going well. They were dealing with a shark. Yeah, they figured they were going to have a success. I, I They figured it was going to be a success, but you're the one getting the material wealth. What's going on for this person? 
the shark was successful. Let's put it that way. Hmm. Financial pinch. Something to do with March. They lost a bunch of money. It's wealth in reverse. They, the, the hell. Yeah, all their secrets coming back out to haunt them. They have no protection. You, you know, this is saying while they were with the collective, they had protection. You were protecting them. And since you're not out in their life anymore, they have none. Absolutely none. No financial protection, no spiritual protection, nothing. Mm. You're getting good luck. Mm. I don't know, you could be this older man getting this good luck. Or it's saying that the collective... Ah... Uh, What's this? This older man might be trying to dealings or a relationship with someone of the same sex. So a friend of theirs or another masculine in their life tried to protect this person. Or maybe this person, this older man is trying to protect you. You are getting a wish granted. Ah, see? What the hell? No peace, no harmony, and now we have another masculine here. Okay, time to bail out of a situation. So, the way I'm seeing it could be taken several different ways here, guys, to be real. This person entered into a meeting with a stranger. Okay? will be important. It's time to bail out of a situation. It's almost as if saying this karmic energy has met someone, a younger man. They were dealing with an older man. This karmic has met and started a relationship with a younger male. Masculine. And somebody's bailing out of the situation. So, yeah, why? Because <laughs> they got no more money, that's why. Very shrewd shark they were dealing with. <laughs> they might have to be going to court. A physician of authority is being called in. Something happened in November. They were too stubborn, aggressive. Pay attention to your health. Their health has been affected. Broken bridge, I'm telling you right now. Doing something risky, taking a chance. So, <laughs> fuck. Okay, you're being shown the way. Lord have mercy. So, what's gone on? Somebody deliberately caused a wedge in between your union. We're dealing with March, November, October, and December here. Major events that have occurred in your life or this person's life. So let me just pull a few more because I want to know. They could have entered into a business contract, made a handshake deal or something in a business thing, but it's either a birth or a business. Either way, they've lost a lot of money. They did something risky, and now they could be going to court over it. Now, if it's a birth of a child, this karmic has met some other masculine, okay? And is bailing out on this older man. If this is a business deal that they went into they were dealing with a shark a financial shark and now they could be going to court because they could have lost their shirt what's going on i think it's i smell a setup so what's this 
person doing now? Now you could be collective, this older man, and there was this younger masculine who come in and created a wedge in your union. They figured that they were going to be successful. They figured they were going to overcome some sort of problem. But somebody made them do something against their will. Now that's the club here. I got yesterday's read that they got a beating. <laughs> yeah, the club. It's like somebody took a beating to this person or something. You know what I mean? Time to bail. They were an opportunist. It was for financial opportunity. So what happened to this person? What happened to this older man and this karmic energy? What's going on? It's like something has got to change. They got to change something. It's in reverse. Some things never change, right? Well, what is change not changed is you're highly thought of. You give good advice. You're a wise person, and I think you probably warned this person. Just saying. Well, they went for passion, but they weren't listening to their intuition. They took the wrong path. Something to do with February now. Ooh, money in reverse. Wealth in reverse. Finances in reverse. Everything is in reverse for this person. I want to find out. Yeah. See? I don't know. There's too many uh, people getting involved here. There's now another younger male. But they were deluding themselves. And it's like unsettled times. See, they should have taken criticism. It was something to do with their money. And now they got all these problems. They were too focused on sexual matters. So... Either the karmic energy is entertaining several masculines and they've been blown over for a younger masculine. It was all a money grab. They probably bought them a business, probably invested with them, paid a lot of money out. They, and now they want to take a beating to this person. <laughs> oh, yeah. There's some court involvement here. Either, you know, legal charges about finances or... Wow. Honor your feelings. Shine. Trust all will be well. Know your worth. Think it through. They were told to think something through. Tune in to the divine. Focus on the positive and see the bigger picture. Keep your heart open. A release control. So somebody was trying to control them or maybe they were trying to control a situation. Somebody was trying to make them do something against their will that they did not want to do. And it seems as if somebody has been telling them Oh, look at the positive side of things. Oh, this could be a success. They didn't listen to their intuition. So what's going on currently between uh, the soulmates and separation? Healing. What's currently going on? Anxiety. Yeah, this karmic is figuring that they were going to get a bunch of uh, abundance 
and have a victory. And But this person is starting to think, they started thinking, man with a coin, walking away. But they're not walking away with the coin. For some of you upright masculines, you escaped. <laughs> you didn't walk away. You escaped. you thinking, if I want to be victorious here and I want to hold on to my coin, I got to walk away. Intuition. Yeah, yeah. See, envy. Envy, envy of your happiness. So, door to romance. Karmic's family, other masculine, sexual activity. It's like, <laughs> it was all to deceive this person out of their finances, their harvest. For you upright masculines who managed to escape, you got out, man, you escaped. A really bad situation and I think there is a woman with a big heart here at the other end for you for you feminines who were just this loving nurturing person it was all envy deceit to create a wedge to take what you have to take this masculine's money, to take what was yours and to take what was theirs. They should have appreciated the yin-yang loving connection that they had, but no, they fell for a trap by someone who only cared about money. Saw it as their opportunity for, for for uh, happiness, you know, secrets. Confuse this person. It was all a plan. Thinking, thinking, thinking. How can I get this person's money? Oh, well, they had a soulmate. They had a caring connection. And they let fear and a trap destroy a union. A caring connection who by the way they were very happy with communicating intuition hmm. well, secret mistress I don't know started looking elsewhere has led to this breakup. It's that simple. This emperor. Now, this emperor's heart's been ripped out. They ripped yours out. Now their heart's been ripped out. They have an empress. Yeah. They got some information that's made them very sad. This that's ended because somebody was giving to two and it is a fake ass empress. This empress wants to come in reverse. They thought this was their empress. Wrong. They were giving to the wrong one. Yeah. And here is this younger masculine putting them in a competition, trying to force them to do something that they didn't want to do. Like I said, it could have come to a fisticuffs, like with the clubs. They're not all the same masculine. They're different masculines here. There's one with different colored pants, one with shorts, one with a uh, looks like jeans on somebody else they're not the same person ten wands 
with this other lover. The other lover put them in a competition as ripped their heart out. That's their judgment. Spirit is saying they're getting their judgment. What's this? They're working on their emotions. They're working on something here. Learning something. What are they learning? Oh, they're they're broke. <laughs> That's what they're learning. They're broke. Okay, it's something to do with a vacation or getting in a car or traveling and refusing to see that they were being deceived. Okay, I don't know. It's like pushing. They've been pushed away. It's like they figured that this was solid, but they did something risky. What did they do? Well, they're getting their justice. They could be going to court over this money loss, over a house, over vehicles. Like I said, they spent all their money on this karmic energy, only to be put in a competition, probably beat the shit out of and kicked to the curb by a new masculine of this karmics. Messaging. They want to talk. They're trying to remain strong. It's like they're a, they should have taken leadership to their Ten of Cups. Now they see your worth. How loving you truly were. They weren't thinking. They had muddled thinking. And it's like they ran because they were stuck. They're thinking fondly about the Queen of Wands. This they weren't expecting something with the third party. I, I don't know. They have been taught a lesson. They could be going to court. They're the hermit. This is a court decision, a court ruling. They're the hermit. Time to bail out. You're happy, you're successful, and now they're looking at your happiness. Looking at you as wish fulfillment. Want to come romance you? I don't know. Start a new cycle. Some of you will hear them out, but others of you are just too hurt, too manipulated. But no, they've been hurt and manipulated. That is their judgment. They've invested in something that has only brought them defeat. Jealousy, envy, conflict. Yeah. Gossip, rumor, all the torment while they sleep. All for a little excitement. <laughs> flighty energy third parties instability somebody is time to get out listening to their intuition it is this emperor I gotta go I want to change <laughs> they want to tell you that they've changed they want to what comes around goes around but they want to tell you They were deceived, okay? Yes, betrayed, trapped. They see their soulmate as wish fulfillment.
heartbroken over finances, a business, or a romantic partnership, or both. They've been put in a third party situation and now they're sitting here wanting to come back around, change things, offer commitment to their soulmate. They're not looking in this other area. I don't know, some of you will hear them out, some of you won't. But I can tell you that they got wrapped up in a business situation. It's cost them a fortune like a lot of money for a fake empress spirit is saying don't let this block your heart. Don't let it close off your heart. Know your worth. Trust all will be well. Honor your feelings. You're shining. Just shine. But keep your heart open. Don't let this, you know, think it through. Focus on the positive. See the big picture. Attune to the divine. Yeah. <laughs> you're getting a lot of good luck and success coming toward you I can tell you that if you're this upright masculine you're going to be very successful and if you are the feminine and your masculine has done this to you they've been put in a competition with other masculines someone younger Several. It's been a change for the better for you. It's what you get when you have too much focus on sexual matters. When you have true love, beware, especially. In Money Matters, it was all a plot. All about money. Yep. The thing is, they could have had it all with the collective. Everything. They weren't thinking. They had people buzzing in their ear. They had people causing wedges, people who were jealous, people who were envious of the connection. They allowed people to create a wedge for finances. It was all greed. Take care, collective.